So today I'm taking a little road trip up north. It's about 60 miles, so about an hour and a half driving. I'm gonna meet up with a friend from the East Coast. His name's Dalton. So we've been talking on Instagram and FaceTiming back and forth. He's come out from the East Coast to visit California for a little bit. I'm gonna head up, get a session in, and yeah, see what the day brings. I like taking little road trips throughout California because the weather's always so nice here. Traffic sucks, but you just gotta bite the bullet with that one. So I'm out here with Mr. Dalton. Mr. I'm all the way Mr. from the Mr. East Dalton. Coast. Yeah, <laughs> sir. <laughs> um, yeah, he's from the East Coast. So you're from Penn, Pennsylvania. Yeah, I'm from like an hour north of Philly, like okay. Allentown, Bethlehem area. Sick, sick. Yeah, Lehigh Valley. Yeah, and this is your second time out on the West Coast. Yeah, I've been, I was out here when I was like 10. My Nana lives out here. Yeah. Uh, and I just came out again, I'm 23 now. So, so it's like, been over a Yeah, it's been like, yeah wow 12 okay, 13 cool. years yeah. since i've been out here how is and it now that you're older out here like well i actually like got to meet my grandmother which was <laughs> which was awesome like yeah, as yeah. an adult like have a conversation with my yeah. grandmother in person at least yeah and then like i don't know the only thing that i have to say is that everything is dry yeah it's so dry yeah like my eyes hurt like yeah. pretty much all the time like, I, I had that same problem when i came out here after a day of skating my eyes felt so dry and red and irritated because it's so dry out here yeah whereas on the east coast it's a bit more yeah yeah a bit more humidity same with australia but yeah what do you think of the skate parks out here compared to back east uh the one that i went to in barstow was a little wonky like transition wise yeah. but it was it was really awesome i haven't seen any like prefab parks everything's yeah, concrete yeah it's very rare to That's... see prefab out here out out our area like i think we have we have like maybe three or four like really notable concrete parks okay. and then there's a lot of stuff that's like half concrete half prefab or full prefab yeah right yeah that's different man i mean i haven't been out to the east coast yet but yeah yeah this th this stuff feels really sturdy to me you were saying earlier yeah that he like stuck to my board yeah he jumped on and like just started shredding and like yeah. he just looks so solid on his board yeah like this it was stuff, crazy i'm used to like hopping around on like prefab ramps okay. and stuff that yeah. are like they've got like sketchy. bolts sticking out of them and are real sketchy <laughs> that's so, east like, coast style though yeah like <laughs> this stuff is so like smooth it's so smooth it's weird almost yeah honestly sick. it's so smooth it's weird yeah it's like glass almost yeah it's yeah, yeah. exactly especially cool. with the sand sitting all over it yeah man well, that was yeah, nice to meet you bro yeah, yeah nice thanks for uh, yeah <laughs> coming out and clips. skating yeah we're gonna get some clips right now some skating clips if i can warm up <laughs> <laughs>
It's not your first time in a bowl of such pool, is it? It's not your first time like skating a bowl or a pool or anything? <laughs> uh, it could be, judging by <laughs> Right after that statement too, <laughs> it's like slip. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Woo. We're getting up there. Victorville skate park, pretty sick. I'll give you guys a little tour right now. There's this pretty crazy bowl slash pool section here, coping around that side. Pool coping here. We've got this three block here that's like kind of like a bleacher type of set. Fun to skate, but kind of scary too, because if you slip out and fall, you're gonna end up at the bottom there. And some more transitions, little elbow here, the nipple. Cool little pyramid thing here that goes over into a bank. What is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven set. The down rail. Baby Euro gap here. This is a fun section. There's a manual pad, an out rail, another flat bar here, but it's square, which is unfortunate. Really fun rainbow rail over here. Kind of roller, fun box type thing here. Pretty sick hip. And massive down ledge with a big hubber to jump onto. It's really hard to get speed to ollie onto this. Like I got onto it before, but you have to like huck an ollie to get onto it really steep how high is it yeah that gives you guys a bit of uh insight to see how oh, look at those tall bubbles. this is oh those bubbles? Yeah, bubbles i didn't even grip. notice that the guy the guy at uh uh menace beach set stuff. it up for you set it up for me you need a refund mate call go around. back and call <laughs> uh there's an a-frame here big a-frame rail with a roller on the side this is all banked around here this is really cool miniature down rail here it's round you can slap you up onto it i don't know what you would call this a euro gap or like a it's a pretty big euro gap for what it is it's only very small transition um i don't know why it's that long if you guys know the name of what they call these things let me know but yeah as you guys can see transition all the way around takes you down to that elbow there Super fun. pretty cool hip i think that's like a four foot Five foot and quarter, not too sure. I think it's four. Four foot? Yeah. yeah. And that leads us around to the rainbow rail, which goes back to the park here. Spawn Ranch built this park. So, you know, Spawn Ranch build quality parks. They usually paint their parks yellow, though, and this park is blue. This is, this is the color of um, how our park used to be in Quaker Town. This is the exact oh, really? same blue. Yeah, this is what our like old, old park used to be. Quaker Town blue. Quaker Town blue. Quake. Quake Shake. The Panthers. <laughs> Is that the team there? Yeah, the Panthers. <laughs> For all you East Coast dudes, you'll you'll know what he's talking about. Is a football a football team? <laughs> it's, a, it's like in my hometown football team. Panthers. Quaker Town Panthers. Quaker Town Panthers, mate. Not the Penrith Panthers. Um, oh, yeah, but this is. That beautiful show. I did, but you've done a bunch today. I don't think you did one in a line though. 
We can organize it later. Here we go. Big tall shove it. Pop shove it. My bad. There's a roller that goes to like a vert wall here. Oh, that thing's sick. I don't know how tall it is, but it's at least eight foot. But yeah, it's a gnarly little roller. You can pump through, get up the top of that vert wall, pump back down, and have a lot of speed to hit the rest of the park here. So Dalton is actually an artist and he collabed what? with another artist. <laughs> he collabed with another artist. Skylar, her name Skyler, was? Skylar, yeah. Skylar, yeah. Um, they pretty much collabed on this board and he gave it to me earlier today. It's sick. I'll show you guys real quick. Check it out. It's so sick. Hand painted. Um, so you said there was like spray paint and then yeah, paint. Yeah, so there's, and... there's spray paint, acrylic paint, Posca pens, and uh, then just like clear coat and stuff. Yeah, check it out. It's sick. He knows me so well. Look at these chains. So good. I freehanded all the chains. Yeah, it's okay. just like, yeah, man. I was so nervous dude. to freehand those like final oh, lines really? and everything. No, dude. you got it. Like if I, <laughs> I'll show you all the arrows on it. Yeah, done. even the eye, that's so trippy. <laughs> My God. Yeah, that was, the eye was, um the eye was, I did, I'll show you the like original doodle of it. Okay. But the original intention with this was I drew, I think I drew the eye and then the chains and like the frames and stuff. Yeah, yeah. And the goal was like, um, was I want to do two parts of this and then yeah. have Sky do the other two. Okay, so I did cool. the chains and the eye, but she ended up actually painting the eye. Oh, Because I'm... I'm like learning like perspective shapes and stuff like yeah, that, how to yeah. properly do like depthual cylinders, rectangles and all that yeah, stuff. Yeah. So we like just figured it would be way better for me to do that top one with yeah. the spray paint bottle and everything. And then have her yeah, do paint. the eye and the arm because she does like humans all the time, yeah. like eyes and stuff. So we made that shift at the end, but that Hell was yeah. supposed that was supposed to be a tattoo gun here. Okay. But she she decided against it late. Yeah. Oh man, either way dude, this is this thing is sick. Like it's this is gonna be a wall hanger for sure, <laughs> man. This is uh I think this is my fur oh apart from like when we're still building the slab, um a younger kid came one day and he gave me a fingerboard he had painted and it was a replica of the hockey board I was riding. Oh, so I really? guess that was the first piece of fan art, but this is the second. But this is definitely yeah. We this is crazy, impress. man. Yeah, thank you, thank you. This was a lot of fun. Yeah, it's just crazy because like, um, like, dude, I'm from Australia. Like, I'm from the bottom of the earth. Like, there's not much that goes on there. And then you've <laughs> been able to like, kind of connect with me in a way through YouTube and the internet and stuff. And now we're here today and yeah. I think I think the first thing that I said to you, like I walked up to you the first time, and I was like the fan, like the fan thing hit. Like, oh immediately. yeah. I like stuttered. <laughs> I like stuttered. I was like nervous. Oh I was, no, like, yeah. I was like, fuck, dude. I'm I was pretty, like, we're really starting like this. <laughs> I'm pretty down to earth, pretty chill, man. Like, yeah, it's just crazy different perspective, man. But yeah, wow, thank you. Absolutely. Thank you so much. So big shouts out to Skylar and Dalton for painting me that board. Super, super happy with it. I'm still kind of blown away by like how I was able to kind of influence type of thing just from my YouTube videos to uh, reach those guys on the other side of the world basically and for them to come together and then paint me a board. Pretty sick, like thank you. If you guys want to check out the rest of their art, I'm going to leave the links in the description below. Go check them out on Instagram, chuck them a follow, support local small artists pretty much it had a rad day skating up at victorville apart from the heat i think i might have to get some glasses for skating out here maybe i need to get some glasses or something because my eyes are so dry at the end of the day it sucks but yeah cheers for watching and until next time guys i'll see you in the next video